Okay, guys. Well, I am excited to see so many faces on such a short notice. Um, today's December the 1st, and it's exciting. We've been waiting for uh, December 1st to hit to see what 31 was going to do for us this month as far as sales and incentives and all the things. And they dropped it all today. And there's a lot of fun things happening. And so I thought it would be fun tonight just to come on and let me tell you what's going on. Most of you guys have probably already been on TOT. If you've been at work today, you may have missed some of the just interaction out there on some of the social media pages. But my goal tonight is to just kind of let's just walk through it together. Let's look at TOT together and let me show you where you can find all the stuff because everything I'm going to tell you is out on 31today.com. It's all out there. But sometimes I think when they drop so much at one time, it just becomes overwhelming. And uh, I see Carrie's got her Santa hat on. And I feel like today we all of a sudden are supposed to go into Santa mode. And so I'm glad you got your hat on. I've got mine laying here. I'll put it on in a second. Um, but I feel like we've got 12 days to really like be excited. Our, our excitement is going to be contagious with our customers. And I know a lot of you guys are probably even a little tired from all the stuff we had going on in November. So they have just been layering and layering and layering. But that is what's happening in the world today is that um, customers are looking for ways to save. They're looking for ways to shop easy and get something, you know, for their buck. And so 31 is doing exactly what all the retail companies are doing. They've released their Black Friday sales early. Um, they're giving bigger discounts than we've given before. And then today they um, shared a lot more with us that we have to offer our customers. So here's what I want you guys to do. I want you to think about the month of December. We're going to look at the entire month of December and we're going to kind of to plan out um, each week. Okay, so if you have a calendar in front of you, let's just look at it. Let's look at your calendar together. And um, if you start today, today is Thursday, today's December the 1st. We know that we have through the 12th for uh, continental U.S., uh, to be have our orders in to guarantee Christmas delivery. Now, I know Alaska and Hawaii is a little different and uh, Canadians are a little different as well. But in the continental U.S., you have until December the 12th to put your orders in to guarantee Christmas delivery. Now, with that being said, that's our date. That's the date that we're going to get it shipped out. I know they'll do some overnight and some rush uh, shipping like they've done in the past if need be. So you guys can really push that with confidence right now. So the first 12 days where we're going to be really, really focused on um, the 50 up to 50% off sale, the bacon take that they're giving away and some of the other things um, that we're going to look at. And then if you guys will kind of look back down to your calendar, you know that we've got a lot of holidays coming out. Well, Y'all probably have already seen, or you probably even have suspected it, that we are going to have an outlet sale in December. And if you've not seen that, um, hopefully this will be exciting news to you. We always do an outlet sale, usually twice a year. Nanette, you're cracking me up with Disney getting your Santa hat there. Um, but I will tell you guys that outlet sales should not be any surprise to you. We, we usually do two a year and they're going to release the information on the 15th. Okay, so I just want you to go ahead and settle your bellies right now and know that one is coming, but you don't have to worry about it until later, the end of the month, um, but they are going to uh, give, us the, give us all the details on the 15th of the month. Okay, so just... Put that, mark that down on your calendar. You'll know the details that day. Until then, let's just put that to the side, but we know we have that at the end of the month, okay? And then we know that um, our catalog, our fall catalog, which is this one, our fall catalog and our holiday capsule, those are both ending on December the 30th, okay? So if you're looking at your calendar, you know that you'll have 15 days, um, not 15 days, but you know you have uh, until the 30th to sell out of these two catalogs. And then on December the 31st, we're going to actually launch the winter catalog. 
Okay, so the winter catalog is going to launch on the 31st. Now they did that strategically and you already knew that because if you look at the back of the catalogs, um, you can see down here on the very bottom. So look at the very bottom of your catalog if you've got one and they have the end date on the bottom of that. So you, that's no surprise. You already knew that this one was ending on December the 30th. But if you ever do forget, it is on the back of all of the collateral that we can purchase. So they're launching the winter catalog on December the 31st. So just so you know, so anytime that we launch a new capsule or a new catalog, we always have a retirement list as well. So you know at the end of the month, you'll also have a retirement list of things that are not going to be moving forward. And those are typically fall, fallish kind of things, you know, that don't move forward. So if you've been around for a while, you know that that will be coming and they will give that to us on TOT. If you're new, um, if you've not been through a holiday season with us, this is the exciting month because we're doing a lot of shifting and shaking this month. So write that down. We're doing shifting and shaking this month. One is we're kind of just kind of shifting with the season and knowing that we're moving into a new season, um, but we also have to shake a little bit at the beginning of this month because we know people are Christmas shopping. So if you look at that calendar, you have something to be kind of doing and something to be looking forward to. The first 12 days of December are what we're going to focus in a little bit right now because that's what we know. Now, looking at your calendar. I also want you to mark and put a big heart and a big star and whatever you need to do to mark December the 3rd. December the 3rd is the day that we're going to have our spring or sorry, winter premiere. We're going to have our winter premiere and it's going to be online. It's going to be in our Facebook pink bubble community page. If you're not in the pink bubble Facebook page, I posted the link today or actually emailed it to everybody today or I can give that to you. That is our home office kind of um, community, uh, their Facebook online community. And they're going to be doing the premiere in that um, space. Now, if you can't do it at uh, 10 a.m. Central Time, 11 a.m. Eastern Time, that's where it's going to be parked. So anytime there's something live on any of the Facebook groups, it's there for you to come back and look at later. Um, and I know a lot of you guys even like to go back and uh, see it a second and third time. So it will be there just in case you can't get on that live premiere. But you want to be on that premiere because that's going to start getting getting you excited about the winner. You know, that's going to get you excited about the winner catalog. OK, um, yes, Jenny, you have to work that day, but it will be out there for you to look at when you get off. So I love, love, love that they do that. So um, and in the comments, if y'all can see the comments, y'all can comment on there if you're going to be live or you're going to watch it later, because I think that that's OK. So tell me if you're going to watch it live, or if you're going to watch it later. The important thing is that you watch it. It's more than just seeing the products. It's getting the information. It will be two hours long. So if you're marking your calendar, um, they've already told us it'll be about two hours long. Um, knock on wood, technology works okay that day. But they're going to also on um, the third, and I'll pull them out in just a second. Where are they? Okay, I want y'all to look at this. You heard if you came on early. You heard me and Carrie talking about it a little bit, but if y'all, do y'all know what these are? Do y'all know what these are? So on the third, they're going to tell us all the information about our next incentive trip. Okay. I do know that our incentive trip earning period will be about a year. So we will have a year to earn the next incentive. Okay. And uh, that's how long they gave us to earn our Hawaii trip couple of years back, we earned a trip to Hawaii, but the Disney trip, Nanette, I'm sorry if your dog is hearing me, Nanette's dog's name is Disney, y'all, and then we have a girl named Renee Disney, so a lot of Disney in our um, 31 family, but they're going to tell us all the details, so I'm just going to go on and tell you right now, if you came on tonight, for me to tell you all the magical information about Mickey Mouse and Minnie, but I don't know it. I'm not going to tell you tonight. You'll find that out on Saturday and then all the stuff will be out there. So know that if you are ready to kick your business up a notch, there's going to be a pretty magical incentive that we all have the opportunity to earn. It's not a director uh, incentive. It's not an elite consultant incentive. It's a top achievers trip. OK, so anybody can earn it no matter where your level is or when you joined. OK, all right. So I'm just going to get that out, right, because I know y'all were probably thinking I was going to tell you I'm not. You'll hear that on Saturday. 
All right, so let's talk a little bit about December. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to let you see my screen and I'm going to show you how you can find all the information yourself because it's all out there. You just have to know kind of where to find it. OK, don't look at all my icons on my dashboard. Somebody always tells me I have too many on there. All right, so here is 31today.com. Now, the first thing you need to know if you're a new consultant on the call tonight, you have to know your consultant ID number to get into 31today.com. Okay, so 31today.com is uh, the website that is open for all active consultants. When you log into 31 today, you're going to see lots and lots of stuff that's kind of right on the on the dashboard. I would tell you to get very familiar with your dashboard because this is where you're going to find out what your sales are. Um, this is where you're going to see a, a trip in, or the Disney incentive tracker will be up here tomorrow or not tomorrow, but in a couple in a little bit, it'll be up there for you. Um, but most importantly is right in the middle. There's a scrolling um, pictures. There's some scrolling pictures. Those are kind of what the current happenings are. So even if you just read what items are scrolling the top, you would be in the know a lot more if you um, did that than nothing. OK, so they do have some things that need to be taken out. So um, the first place I always go to when I'm trying to figure out what's going on during the month is I will go over on the left hand side to the marketing tab. So on the left hand side, there's a, a tab called marketing. And I'm going to click on that marketing tab underneath the marketing tab. We usually have three months. And so you can see we've got December, January and February. Now, that's not all populated. We'll see these populated after the premiere on Saturday. But if you were just trying to figure out what the heck is happening in the month of December, you always have a marketing material tab for the month and then all the extras that's happening. So the first thing that we want to look at is kind of just the De December marketing material in general. So you guys know Guarantee Christmas Delivery is December the 12th. So that's the first thing that they tell you right here on the front is that, OK, y'all, let's get focused. We've got until December the 12th. And you know what? It's actually including Alaska and Hawaii. I misspoke on that. I thought theirs was a different uh, date, but it's December the 12th, too. Canadians have December the 5th. Now, with that being said, Make sure that when you look at graphics, if you're sharing graphics in your customer um, uh, pages, sometimes it'll be a Canadian graphic and it won't have a maple leaf on it. So if you see a graphic, most of the um, consultants will put a little maple leaf on it. If you see that, that's a Canadian graphic someone has made. So our graphic um, will say, say December the 12th deadline. OK, so don't um, don't confuse that with their deadline. OK, you always have a playbook each month that has a calendar in it. We can look at that. You, it tells you kind of what I've already told you. This is our last chance for our catalog. This is the last month. Um, it's telling you to share it. It gives you some more um, tools to share. Now it comes down here to the newness, uh, December newness and last chance. So we've got a holiday collection. That's that that capsule that I just showed you a minute ago. That's going to be ending. And it says December 31st at 8 a.m. Um, so they flip everything now uh, in the morning because of our different time zones. So it used to be it would end December the 30th at midnight or November the 30th at midnight. Or, you know, we always give them to 8 a.m. because um, California is two hours behind me, three hours beside, behind e uh, Eastern time zone. So to just kind of make the playing field fair, they do 8 a.m. kind of the next day. OK. Um, fall collection is ending soon. Now, this is the big thing, the bonus insider gift. So we're going to talk about this a little bit more in depth, but anybody that has a $300 party submitted in December the 1st through December the 12th, they're going to get a free bake and take. We'll look at some of the um, graphics to go with that. Now, here's the number one question that I got asked today. What if I have a, a shopping link open that has orders on it that were placed in November? Will that count towards the, the 300? Yes. As long as those hostess um, insider rewards didn't expire, uh, if you carry a party over into December that has orders from November, as long as you submit that party by, no, uh, by December the 12th, you can get that bacon take. I actually had a $300 party um, that 
I, I have out there and I didn't, there was no reason that I had to close it in November. So that will count. If you've got shopping links open that have orders from November, you can come, you can close those parties in December and just by December the 12th and get that free bacon take. Okay. Everybody give me a thumbs up in the, um, in the chat, if that makes sense. I want to make sure that, that, um, that makes sense. Um, Hopefully I can't see the chat, but y'all give everybody a thumbs up. Somebody has a question, somebody let me know. Um, okay, so they also launched a up to 50% off uh, sale today. And that's December 1st through December 12th. Now, again, it's actually till 8 a.m., but just for simplicity through the 12th, okay? Okay, so we're, we've got um, December 1st through the 12th. I keep saying that, that we've got to get our orders in. We've got something for the hostess at the $300 level, y'all, that's crazy. And then we also have something for the customers and that's our up to 50% off sale. Now, there's also something in it for you as a consultant and that's the pre-sale. And we're gonna look at that in a little bit more detail, but I promise you, if you guys will just look at all these things here on the marketing tab, you're going to find all the things, okay? Now, also our 31% off um Full price if you spend 50 is back so that's our normal customer special it went back to our normal spend 50 get anything 31 percent off so it's all here for you if you scroll down uh, there's that canadian leaf i was talking about make sure you don't use those let's look at the collateral for uh the bacon take so they gave us um a picture that we can share in our customer groups that we can use just to educate us. And that is basically, you know, party between December 1st to December the 12th, you'll get a free bacon take with a $300 party while supplies last. Okay. Now, just like any other company, we are um, at risk of running out of them, but they do think that we're okay. We've got three prints. Um, they do have some from the fall that if had to, they could, but we've got three prints that this comes in. Okay. So, let me let me stop that. Okay, so let me just take a minute, um, and hopefully you guys can all see me. Uh, let me see. Oh, Christy says, "What if there is a 300 order within a party with that customer insider both get the bacon take?" No, so it's just an insider special. Okay, so if you had a customer that ordered $300 on that party, that order's already been submitted. She's supporting her friend. Um, she's not going to be eligible for that bacon take. It's going to own that reward only goes to the hostess. Good question, though. So that gives you an opportunity. So let me pull out um, kind of my bacon take. Now, I've got one from the fall. So this is not a current print. But if you've not seen this, first of all, look how big this is. Like, it's really big. You see me holding it. Here's a, a tiny utility tote just to kind of give you some comparison if you can see that. Okay. Underneath, there's actually a 9 by 13 casserole carrier. You can put, I've seen people uh, roll up hot dogs in aluminum foil and take this to the ball field. I've seen parents load this up with Capri Suns, all the drinks and bombs. So you think nine by 13, but anything that you need to be thermal, you can put in here. Most all nine by 13 pans will fit in here. It does not come with the nine by 13. It's just the bacon take cooler. Um, I know we had a bundle that had something with it. This one is just the bacon take cooler. Okay. So you've got this. Okay, and then on the front of it, this is where the personalization goes, and you probably can't see, I did tone on tone on mine, but the charcoal, it'll actually pop a little bit more. This is just a, a, a pocket on the front that you can put recipe cards in there, or you can put, you know, some plastic wares or napkins or whatever you need to put in that pocket and drop your cell phone keys down there. Now, on the inside of it, let me open this, um, it's a big cooler. You can put your big Tupperware bowls down in here. You can put you know, any of the things that you uh, need to keep keep cold or, or warm. Now, somebody asked me the question, if I put a taco hot casserole carrier under there and I want to put my, you know, strawberry dessert here, will this stay cold and that stay hot? They are two separate compartments, but remember heat rises. So if you've got a really hot thermal under here, I'm sure it's going to melt some of that whipped cream or whatever you have. Okay. I'm not a cook. Y'all should know that. I'm kind of making it up as I go. All right. So I know that you can put your 9 by 13 underneath here and you've got a cooler here. 
$300 party will get this bag absolutely for free. It doesn't cost you anything as the consultant. They will have to pick out which print that they want. Um, so what I'm doing, I'm going to show you what I'm doing. Oh, wait, before I, well, let me, let me zip this and I'll show you. Okay. So I posted, um, I posted somewhere and I can share it again. Um, I posted a couple of things in my own customer page. And if you're working your customers, um, this could be something that you decide you want to do. Let's see. Charlotte says, so just to make sure if their party started in November and closed before the 12th, they will get the bank intake. Yes. When you enter the insider rewards, that's now going to be one of the options for them to get. I think it's actually hostess. It's called hostess bonus, maybe. Um, but they will be able to add it. And I can show you that. So, yes, if you've got parties that came from November that haven't closed yet, those will count. So how many of you guys have party links open right now that are already over 300? Yeah. So you're a shoe in. Just remember, it's while supplies last. OK. Um, let me show you what I did. I want to show you. I want to be able to make sure that you know exactly what I'm doing. There's nothing I'm doing that you can't do. This is my customer Facebook page. OK. And I can't see you guys. So hopefully y'all can see this. Um, let me scroll Kelly, you're the first one I see. Can you see my screen? Yes. OK. All right. So this is my customer group. Um, this is what I posted today. I'm doing a mystery hostess. I don't need anything for myself. So I'm doing a mystery hostess party. I set up a shopping link. Uh, you can see that link is here on my um, in my virtual office. I set up a mystery hostess party and I'm doing um, um, some tickets. So if they spend 49, they get one entry, they spend 50. And this is what I said. Orders over 300 free bacon taken thirty dollar, you know, thirty dollars for free. So they have if they you know order that I'm like, oh, my gosh, I got to make sure that, you know, they they'll automatically get it. Um, but the mystery hostess party is if they're doing, if they're ordering on a link, they don't have 300, they don't want to share a link, then they get a chance to win it. So what I'm personally doing is I'm doing a mystery hostess link. And as soon as it hits $300, which I'm hoping I have that happen a lot, as soon as it hits $300, I'm going to close that shopping link. And I say close, I'm just going to uncheck it where it doesn't show on my website anymore. And then I'm going um, to probably come in and edit and delete this link um, and post a different link. So every time it hits 300, I'm wanting to do a drawing and give away the rewards. And so um, what, I'll, what I'll do is I'll message that girl. So let's say Kelly was the winner. I'd message Kelly and I'd say, you know, hey, Kelly, you were the winner. It's winner take all. You get the free bacon take plus the $30 in hostess uh, credit. But oh, by the way, if you wanted to host uh, this link and share it with a couple of family and friends, when it hits $500, you will actually get a $100 shopping spree. So I'm doing mystery hostess party in my customer group. Whoever wins, I'm going to say, hey, do you want to try to increase that to get the $100 shopping spree, which, you know, at $500 level, they get $100 in hostess credit. She only needs $200 more and she'll get $100 credit, $100 shopping spree. Plus, we have our normal monthly special, which is the zipper pouch and this for $10. So every month we have a hostess special when the party hits $500 they can get something. This month it's $10 to get this set. Okay, so they get this set for 10. They'll get the bacon take for free with a $500 party. They'll get this for $10. They'll get the bacon take for free plus $100 in hostess credit to spend. That's just our normal hostess credit chart. Okay, it's in the back of the catalog if you want to look at it. All right, does that make sense? Jenny, you said you're excited for this set. Yeah, for $10. She may push for an extra two hundred dollars in orders, um, but my purpose, my purpose of telling you guys that is I don't want you to sell yourself short of getting your hostess to three hundred dollars and then quitting and telling her, OK, she's done. Encourage her to get you know to the five hundred dollar level because that's where they get the hundred dollars in hostess credit. That's where they're going to earn the hostess special for the month. And it's ten bucks this month. OK, that makes sense. 
Okay, so this could be these first 12 days, this could be the time where you're really doing some good customer care call outs. So if I was challenging you to do something, I would challenge you to make the ask of if they would like to work on earning the bacon take for free. Most people, if you set them up a link and they share it with, you know, five people and those five people order, they're going to have a $300 party. People are spending, and I'll tell you all this because I just found this out. Um, let me make sure I tell you right. The average spend right now per customer, do y'all want to know that number, uh, is $121. Our average spend per customer right now is $131, and our average party is $729. So we're just asking that our hostesses do a $300 party and they get a $59 bag for free. Okay, so if you're looking at your business, you're like, where do I need to start? I would post something on your customer platform, if, whether that is Facebook or Instagram or whatever platform you use. You can also send an email out from your virtual office. I can show you how to do that. But then the next thing I would do is I would actually be making the ask. I would be sharing that graphic. Um, I've shared a couple of graphics actually in our lineage. Probably your, your directors on their team pages have shared some. I can share some at the end of the call on the lineage page. Um, but all I did like today, I sent a girl a picture of that girl holding the Oh What Fun, you know, and I sent it to her and I said, hey, um, and her name is Mary. I said, hey, Mary, I know you've been thinking about um, hosting a party for a while. Can I share with you what we've got going on for the next 12 days? When you share a shopping link and they sh they shop on your link um, and you get to 300, you're going to get the bacon take for free. How would that sound? And she booked a party just because I asked. I said, when you share that shopping link with three or four people and you get to $300 in orders, you get this for free. So I don't want you to overthink it. I don't want you to feel like you have to go do elaborate parties. You only have 12 days. And honestly, women right now are busy. They just want a link. Like, just give me a link. If you use your app, if you use the 31 app, I would encourage you guys all to get that on your phone. When you set up a party, there's two things that you can actually share. You can sh share the shopping link, but there's also an RSVP link. I've been using that link quite a bit and they will RSVP for the party. And then you can use the hostess portal in your virtual office. So I know that's a lot of training, but I want you to just think like if you could ask, you know, 10 or 15 people, they said, you know, our 15 connected contacts a week, if you've done that training, the, if you're making 15 reach outs, ask them all to book a shopping link. OK, they they can save and the customers can save with the 50 percent off sale. OK. That makes sense. OK, um, let me share my screen again. Um, the whole point is I just want you guys to have a plan. I want you to have a plan of uh, what you're working on. OK. All right. Uh, it didn't share my screen, did it? Let's see. Let me share my screen again. Oh, I'm still on Facebook. OK, here's the picture. Let me scroll down. This was my this is my um, customer page. Uh, don't look at all. OK, here's the picture. So here's the picture that I sent. So here's your here's your like tip. If you've done any of my leadership calls before, you know, this is a tip when you Facebook message people. If you will send the picture first, hit put the picture and then hit send and then write your verbiage, they can't preview the message. So if they if you send the picture first, so um, let's just say I'll just does that make sense? Do you see what I'm saying? Um, hang on. Let me grab this picture. I'm going to show you because this is a really big tip I learned from one of the girls that tag team. Um, so let's just say, who am I looking at? Jenny. So if I'm messaging Jenny, here she is. Okay, so if I was pulling up Jenny's name, I would pull this up. I would send her a picture, okay? And then I would type in the message, hey, Jenny, and whatever I'm going to say. So when Jenny sees that, so she's over there looking at it, she can't see what I type until she opens it. So if I would immediately said, hey, Jenny, I was wanting to see if you wanted to book a party, she's probably not going to open it. Send the picture first, then send your message. OK. Does that make sense? 
I'm asking y'all that and I really can't see y'all very well. I can see Kelly, Jenny, and Tina. <laughs> okay, so um, let me go back. I must have logged out of 31 today. There's a couple of tips. So I want to give you guys a bunch of tips. If I was focusing and doing my business today, that's exactly what I did. My whole goal today is to set up some shopping links, but I know that there's going to be some people that don't want to shop. So I'm going to offer them a mystery hostess link to shop on. Okay. All right. So you've got the sale happening too. So if you clicked on the 50% off sale, that's right there on the, your dashboard. There's an entire product list that you can look at. It tells you everything that's on the up to 50% off. I have to say that up to 50%. And it tells you what the retail price was and what the U.S. price is. Okay, so these all about the Benjamin's wallet. Look how many we've got for $29. So I would encourage you if you're doing some customer follow-up, go back and look and see who had who bought maybe the Ditsy, De, uh, Ditsy Pebble Cindy Tote or, you know, look and see who's purchased on, with that print before and see if they want to add um, a coordinating wallet. So you can do some good customer service with this. You've got a lot of um, $10 items on here as well, like these littles. They're all 10 bucks. Just so y'all know, our Littles is our number one giftable. Every year we go, people go crazy over those because they're they're usually cheap and they can do some things with them. Okay, um, how many of you guys earned um, the stocking? Do you remember when you sold $500, you got the stocking for free? So yes, Karen, earn it, Tina, earn it, Diana. Okay, so you guys all have the stocking and those are on the sale as well. So if you earned the stocking, Sue earned it, Christy earned it. Okay. If you earned it, you have it. You have this, and this is part of the sale. So how are you going to use your incentive that you earned for free to advertise the stockings being on sale? Okay. So here's mine. And I actually had mine today. I had this little, little, uh, the tiny utility tote. If y'all didn't realize that two littles will actually fit down in the tiny utility tote. So here's my little truck. And then two littles will go down in here. So if you, if you are um, thinking about gifts and how you can share, this is only $10 on the up to 50% up off. And these, I think, are, are, they, are they 29? Somebody look. I think they're 29. Um, this is a $39 gift. People are always looking for $40 gifts. Like how stinking cute would that be for maybe a new baby that's born or maybe somebody that uh, is a neighbor or somebody that cuts your hair? That's a $40 gift right there that could be really nice. And you could put something on it or not personalize it. You, If you didn't want to personalize um, the, the stocking, you could always get one of the littles that have the print on there already. Like I love the little polar bear. I love the red and white stripe, like I'm kind of a classic girl, but I mean, look how stinking cute that is. So think about, you know, $40 gifts that you guys can um, promote to your customers that are looking to save. So both of these are, are on sale. Um, if they personalize it, now they qualify for the customer special. They can get 31% off of anything in the full catalog. So this personalized would qualify them for the customer special. Now, if y'all are watching the business update, did you guys see that the square utility totes are back? And I've got tone on, I do a lot of tone on tone, see the W on the W. The square utility tote is back. So if you had people that was interested in this before, I know Tyree Tui and Amanda Thompson, they both sold one of these in the first hour this morning because they had people that were waiting for them. Okay, so these are back. Go look in the real life pages and find some pictures and talk about that. They can get 31% off of that on their customer special. Okay, so now they've got that and that. They're a third of the way to a party of their own. Share the link with a couple of people and now they've earned the free bacon take. Okay, so stack some of those ideas on top of each other. All right, so... Um, We've got a sale going on. Our customer special is reverted back to normal. Now, I want to uh, talk about one thing that I know that I've heard people talk about, and then um, we'll I'll show you one more thing, and then we'll be done. I'll open it up to question and answers. Um, so I have been hearing that people are um, worried about charging shipping to our customers, or they hate to pay shipping. Okay, so let me just kind of address that. I will tell you guys, I cannot go to the post office and mail this to anybody, whether they're in Tennessee or California for $8.95. I can't. 
And so when you think about shipping, shipping is not always free on Amazon. So I know people are like, Amazon doesn't charge shipping. Well, they do charge shipping unless you pay Amazon Prime, which is a yearly fee. Um, but I just want you guys to be confident in our shipping cost. I can order something and have it shipped out to uh, Colorado, to Nanette for $6.95 if it's under $100 or $8.95 if it's above. So we have a flat rate shipping. It doesn't matter what the weight or the size or the distance is. It is a flat shipping fee. It's either $6.95 if it's $100 or more or $8.95 if it's under. So think about how big our deluxe utility totes are, how big those are. They put those in a full box to protect them. I can ship a deluxe utility tote, a box full of stuff. I can ship a suitcase. Those suitcase boxes, if y'all have gotten one, they're huge. We can ship those for $6.95 or $8.95. So I want you to be confident that you cannot take your products to the post office and mail them for as cheap as $31 and packaging. Remember, it's shipping and handling. Okay, so I just want y'all to be confident in our shipping. I know a lot of people do have free, um, but we cannot drive our products even across town for that amount. Okay, so gas and the cost of boxes and stuff. Um, okay, let's see. Tina, you said I was going to order a beer bucket online from a copy for $10, but shipping was $12. I love you buying a beer bu bucket. Like, I need to know more about this beer bucket. Was it personalized? I need to know. I need to know about the beer bucket. Okay. Um, so I, I hope that this kind of makes sense. If you wrap your head around the month of December, you kind of know what's going on. If we focus in on the first 12 days of what we have to offer, we have a sale, we have um, a free bacon take, and of course, we have our normal all day, every day hostess program. But then you think about people are shopping for gifts and they're looking to save. You can save them on shipping. You can save them on cost because we got the sale. You can save them on cost of full price items with our customer special. And of course, um, um, you guys can save them with the hostess program. Okay. Um, Carrie, what did you say? Yes, the party will need to be submitted by 12 12 to get the free bacon take. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Answering the question. All right. Um, I was going to show y'all one thing. Oh, let me tell you about the pre sale. So, you guys know that um, our winter catalogs are out there available for you to purchase now. That catalog, when does it start? When did I tell you? December 31st. So if you're like me, I ordered mine today. I want to go ahead and get those catalogs in hand. Um, and I ordered 40 catalogs. Just so y'all know, I ordered 40 because they go through the month of April. Okay, so the catalog is from um, January to April, the end of April. Our catalogs are going to be four months now. We'll have three catalogs next year. Each of them will be four months long. OK, so if you're ordering catalogs, just kind of think about how many you would need for the season. You may buy one pack or you may go ahead and buy 40 like me and you're done. You're done. OK, I'm not mailing as many. I'm doing a lot more virtual links than ever before, but you can order the catalogs today. You could do the pre-sale. Now, we're going into a new product category. You're going to see that on Saturday. If you went to Impact, you already kind of heard a little bit about it. Um, but they're going to show you all that on Saturday. But there is a pre-sale going on right now where you can get some of these products in hand at a discount. It's up to you. If you do decide to buy some of the pre-sale, pre you will get credit for the PV, the personal sales. You won't earn commission on it because they're already 40% off but you, it will earn you some PV. So if you order out of the pre-sale and all of a sudden you see your zero has been stomped, your December sales has now got an amount there, it may be from your pre-sale. You can combine um, your catalogs with the pre-sale to save shipping. So if you're gonna go order today and you order some of the pre-sale bundles, there's three of them, whether you order one or three, you can add a pack of catalogs on there and save you some shipping. OK, so that's up to you guys. I ordered catalogs and the little mini catalogs today. Um, you'll notice the sponsoring uh, flyers are not out there. I'm pushing back on them a little bit because you guys know I love to share the opportunity. Um, they're not going to be released until December 31st. But I'm telling them we need that because we're going to grow our teams. We need them. We don't know early. All right. So does that make 
Yes, I hope so. Let me just go back to TOT real quick to make sure. I showed you the pre the, the sale list that's out on TOT. I showed you the bake and take cooler and gave you some ideas on that. Let me close that. Um, I showed you where to find all the main information. So if you go to TOT, go to marketing, it's all under the marketing tabs. There's tons of graphics. Uh, your, hopefully your director is sharing some in their team page. If not, I'll try to share some more on the lineage. There's tons of graphics out there. If you go back to your home, let me show you one last thing, because this is something I got asked quite a bit uh, in the last week. If you go to your dashboard, you'll see your month at a glance. If you're a hobbyist and you are maybe a personal use consultant, um, you have to have at least $200 in a rolling three months to stay active. So if you look at your dashboard, you will see there's a rolling three month box. As long as that says $200, <clears throat> your account is not at risk, okay? Um, this time of the year, I don't think anybody should have a zero if you're shopping from yourself, you're making from yourself as well, but it's all out there, okay? So you've got pre-sale, you've got catalogs if you want to go ahead and order those, you've got a premiere coming up. Um, Tanya, note the outlet sale does not start on the 15th. They're just going to give us information on the 15th. Okay, so I don't want to tell y'all that date yet until Home Office releases it, um, but you'll have plenty of time to prepare. We'll do a um, boot camp. I'll do an outlet sale boot camp just to help you guys get prepared for it too. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yes, Lindsay, I like to send a sponsor flyer with every catalog as well. So I'm pushing back on them like we and I know the kits will be in the catalog, but there's something about having a separate flyer. OK, so I, we're done with the call. I'm going to turn off the recording um, thank you guys for being on here, but I'm going to stay on for some questions and answers and I can show you some um, back office stuff, too. So let me stop the recording.